Welcome back guys, I'm going to be naming our Vermadam Flora because it sounds cool and it's kind of related to flowers so I think it suits her so Flora the Vermadam welcome to the team after killing Sally thank you for killing Sally by the way I really appreciate it Flora I just want to just murder you but anyways we have Vermadam the normal and water type Pokemon we have Bl <laughs> Blaze okay nice we have Hydro Pump Sunny Day and Grass Knot it's actually cool because we have fire, water and grass type moves. It's actually awesome. But it's kind of useless. Uh, I mean I guess it's not bad. So let's actually leave this place because we have no work over here. And let's go catch some more Pokemon shall we? Also I'm asking see from the time. I'm recording this way after from the previous time. Because uh, the phone calls you guys have been hearing. It was actually my friend calling me for tuition. And after coming to the tuition I got pretty late. so. I'm, I'm recording this late at night, so I'm going to try to like, you know, um, soft slowly and softly as possible, but also not talk really softly and give you guys no entertainment, you know. Anyway, this is Salisian Town, which is actually one of my favorite towns in this game because I love the music, it has the daycare center, it also has this um, building with the uh, newspaper, I don't know if you guys know about that, so if, basically if you talk to him, he'll tell you to catch a Pokemon and he'll give you some free rewards, so that's cool, you know. I also by accidentally, you know, he healed up Sally, who's dead. So that's <sighs> just so depressing. Like the it's, it's basically we're replacing Sally with Wormerdam. You know, it's really sad. Also, I'm gonna get the XP shot of this guy. I'm sorry, Sally. Oh, Kirito. It's, it's really sad seeing the death box because all of them, I I love them. You know, we used every single one of the Pokemon. They were really useful in our journey. And it's really sad to see them, you know, in the dead box. Anyways, this is the Pokemon News Press. See, wanted the pro uh, pro Pokemon catcher. So, if you, he'll tell us to catch some Pokemon. So, if you go tell him, I mean, if you have to show him the Pokemon, he'll give you some cool rewards and stuff. So, that's cool. Also, what am I doing here? First things first, I have to buy some more Pokeballs because I'm pretty sure we're going to run out of them, right? Because, oh my god, Flora just wasted a ton of Pokeballs and Great Balls. So, we have uh, one Great Ball. Sweet, okay. I'll buy six uh, Great Balls. How much Pokeballs we have? Six. Um, obviously, I don't think that's going to be enough. I think I'll sell some stuff. Um, what can we sell? Hail. I'm, not, I'm never going to use Hail. I'm sorry because I don't know weather moves that actually hurt me. It's not the best. So, I'll, using this money, I, I guess I'll buy five Pokeballs. So, we have 12 Pokeballs and I guess seven Great Balls. So, that's good. So, let's make our way to the um, ruins and then catch a Pokemon out there. Because there's no way I'm ending this episode with, you know, like no catching and also dying. Also, I think this is the ruins. Also, we have some Pokeballs. So, I will get them after this catching. So, this is the Salacian ruins. So, let's check out what Pokemon we have. Also, this. What, what am I doing? It's unknown alphabets. If you can actually take your time and decipher these, you're awesome. But I think it says uh, top left, bottom left, like that. It's, it's basically like a, you know, guide out of this place. Also, I don't think you can catch any Pokemon on the first floor or like this ground floor. Also, what? Oh, we found a spell tag. Yeah, there are actually items littered out throughout this place. So, um, you can find many cool items as well as some Pokemon. I also really hope we don't battle any uh, more trainers than I expect because I want to just, you know, take my time catch some Pokemon. Okay, so let's check out. Oh, come on. Okay, let's go deep, I guess. We found nothing. That's awkward. Oh, we got more trainers. Okay, I want to skip this guy. Fine. Oh, any item? No? Oh my god, I can't believe we're, doing, we're actually playing the Solacy and Rubens. I thought I'm doing this in the next episode, but oh well. Also, do we have any escape rope? Oops, I don't, I don't know where I'm going actually, but I guess we can just, you know, follow the path and see where it leads us. We also found a Max Ether. I'm pretty sure this is where you get the Water Stone usually, you know, in the games. But since the game is randomized, of course you get something else. Um, what else? Oh my god, I'm so lost right now. I'm, I'm just, you know, relying on my instinct and just letting everything flow and looks like I was right. So let's pick up all these items. With that we have got a Wee Power Berry, a Miracle Seed, nice, uh, a Super Ocean and of course the Fog. Oh god, the first Pokemon here in this! Wow. Wow, okay. Okay, okay, I, I love this. Altaria, that's fine. Um, the, pro the problem is the catch rate. I don't know the catch rate of Altaria. I'm just gonna hope we can catch this thing. 
Oh god, mighty water. Okay, that's not good. I'm going to go for the return and hope this doesn't kill him. And okay, that did like nothing. Muddy water, if you get this, this guy gets a critical hit. I'm going to like die, but I think we are good. So I'll throw some great balls. Oh God. Seismic toss. So okay, that has damage according to the levels. That's not good. Do we have potions? Yes, we have four super potions. So there is one, I guess. Metal sound, good low, special defense. That's not good. Muddy water is next time. It's going to pain. It's going to, oh, fire fang, okay. Oh god, me, you got me burned, baby. I'm gonna switch to worm, madam. Because of the freaking metal sound, I'm a little bit scared. I'll go for hope again. Here comes to the muddy water. The muddy water should actually heal my burn. Because it's water and I'm fire, the logic, you know. Okay, so I'm gonna heal it back to full HP. Here comes the muddy water again. Accuracy is failing, which sucks. I'll go for another return. Not doing as much, which is good, actually. Okay, another muddy water might kill me actually. So I'm gonna go for Flora. Here comes the seismic toss. Um, I think we can survive the muddy water, right? Because we are normal and water. So we are good, hopefully. Oh, come on, another seismic toss, okay. I think we can live it. We are 30, so we are, we are just gonna barely live. Nice. Let's go for Hope. Fire Fang on a Hope. On a freaking uh, rock type. We have only two super potions left. Not good. I really hope this guy just wastes. You know, by going for Fire Fang. And we can't catch this guy for the life of me. Why? Please. Thank you. Thank you. That was that, that was a really good help. Thank you, game. Thank you a lot. Like, I'm seriously grateful. So, let's check out Altyrus typing. Altyrus did what with the Pokédex. It is going to be a ground and dragon type. Sweet heat. So, humming Pokémon, it, it bonds with a Poké uh, person. It will gently envelop the friend with its soft wings and then hum. Wow, that's actually sweet of Altaria. So guys, I'll think of a nickname and I'll catch you guys back here. I'm going to be naming our Altaria Fluffy because those wings and its body, it's just, it's so soft. I can just feel the fluffiness from here. Also, I used to have a puppy known as Fluffy, but uh, I actually sold it because there was no one to take care of it. So that's a pretty long story and we have Fluffy back in this playthrough. That's fun. Also, do I have um, escape rooms? That's the one. That's the one I have to wonder. And I don't. Okay, I guess the first thing is first I'll heal up everyone. I'm gonna heal up Fluffy. The problem is uh, Articuno Hope is burnt. Um, not the best. Okay, because burning, it hurts. I, I, I know the feeling. So I'm gonna heal everyone to almost full HP. Just in case, you know, because what if we bump into some trainer or some legendary Pokemon, you know. So um, I'm lost in this place. I'm pretty sure. That's the easy way out, but I don't know. I'm just going to just wander and hope we are going through the right place. Um, this place. Oh, okay. We're doing some progress. Oh, we actually made it to the Maniac. Now again, hopefully avoid him. Yep, we did it. Uh, we found the Hiker also. So if I can avoid him. Okay, nice. Oh, oh, he didn't see us. Okay, so maybe he's a good guy. I don't know. Anyways, we made our way out of the ruins. And that's all matters, you know. Phew, that was an easy peasy task. So now uh, let me go grab the Pokeball because it's just so tempting and I love me some Pokeballs. I think th this is the correct path and just kidding, it is the next path. Oh my god, okay. No problem, we can just go another round and this path, right? Nope, it's, oh it is, yeah it is the correct path, yeah. And with that we found, ah that's some nice music. We found the Bloom Mail, cool. So let's go heal up. And uh, go and catch the final Pokemon available to us that is actually towards the north. We, really, we only have three Pokemons. We actually don't... We, the, all we can do is have a full team of four. Not a full team, like almost a half team of four. So, I guess four Pokemon I have to do for now. I mean, Sally's dead. It sucks. Like, it really sucks actually. I, <sighs> okay. So, I, I thought of buying some potions, but I guess we don't have money. So I'm going to take on some trainers, don't know you guys, I will, I will sell some stuff and actually get some money and only take on trainers because I'm not that dumb to take on trainers without, you know, any healing items, you know, I'm not, I'm not that dumb. Um, see how much Pokeballs we have, 11 Pokeballs and 2 Great Balls, will they be enough? They will be enough, okay? Okay, I, mean, I don't want to risk anything, I don't want to risk, I don't want to risk, so I, I guess I have to sell stuff, which sucks because I don't like selling stuff. Also, we don't have any much, we don't have much good items to sell. Uh, how much will this go for? Okay, this goes for 275, uh, not bad. 
Uh, what else can we sell? Honey, we have. Toxic plate, no need. Miracle C, not that much. Silver powder, 50. The Sooth Bell, 50. Deep scale, 100. Thunderstone. Uh, okay, I guess Thunderstone, bye bye. Like, I'm sorry, Thunderstone. I just seen. I need some healing items. If you don't mind me, Thunderstone. Okay, wait a second. I'm, <laughs> I wanted to buy Pokeballs, but I brought potions. Um, that's funny. I, I guess. Okay, so let's actually use the honey and see if we can lure up some rare Pokemon. So let's use the honey and see what we get here in Route 2, not 10, I believe. So the first Pokemon in Route 2, not 10 is... Fortress. The defensive wall. Um, okay, I, I guess it's not bad. But let's go for return. This guy's pretty defensive, so I can... Conversion 2. Rock day. Okay, that, that's even better. Ah, uh, don't kill him, okay. Ominous wind. How ominous. <laughs> that's a joke. It's a joke, okay? And that's all. We found we got Fortress. I thought of ruling, uh, you know, luring some rare Pokemon, but I got Fortress, which is not that rare, I guess. And I see what type this guy is. He's a pure ground type. Huh, interesting. The Bagworm Pokemon. It is encased in hard shell. I mean, steel shell. Its piercing eyes are all that can be seen out of, of its mysterious innards. That sounds gross. So. As always, I'll, I'll catch you guys back here after thing uh, for a cool nickname. This has to be one of the most dumbest nickname I came up with, but I'm gonna be naming our fortress Circle. Even though he's not a circle, he's a spear. I like the nickname Circle, you know, it just it shows you how valuable Fortress is gonna be. I'm just kidding, okay, because I mean, I don't mind being a ground type, but we have fluffy with the, with the ground and dragon type. So, another ground type? Eh, not the best. Anyways, let's check out his ability. He has strength. The strength keeps, I mean, helps keep away wild Pokemon. Whoa, it's basically like a repel. That's awesome. So we have Mega Horn, Twister, Ominous Win, and Conversion 2. I'm also curious, what is Conversion 2? I never understood those moves. So Conversion 2, the user changes its type to make itself resistant to the type of attack it last took. Sweet, that's actually not a bad move. So I guess that's all guys, we actually caught some Pokemon, we also killed some, this is not fun. So hope you enjoyed this episode of Pokemon Random Extreme Randomizer as Lock. if you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, and as always guys, I'll catch you next time, goodbye.